Okay, so I'm gonna do my hero's fest summons. And for those seeing me eat some food, I just drove back up to Miami and I'm really hungry. So, meantime, I'm doing my phone until the game finishes loading itself up and through. Uh, yeah. Okay. I should have just finished loading up and through now. Yay. I haven't been able to do my summons yet. Because it started on Friday, and I couldn't do them Friday. Couldn't do them Saturday because I was driving to Miami. Slept just today. <laughs> You're going to watch me make a mess as a tree eating. Burger. Technically, two turkey burgers. Evie, girl, you've had so much cat food, you're not getting any of my food from me. I don't see a good reason to keep him. I don't think he's one of the guys I need to keep. I guess I'm gonna have to go check. Molemen crab thingies or not.
I actually thought about this. I think this bat dude probably going to be good against the um, level 8 Tower of Chaos guy. So I make a dark bat to Evo 3 already. I did make the Evo, what does he do? He's a attacker, he might be home. Well, well maybe he would be, but what about I haven't completed yet? He'll give me an extra 60 Astro Gems. I can always get more dark bats. Alright, so I should get a snail, a cactus. where I can catch a snail, and then I need cactus. Hey, Astro Panda. I'm catching one of these snails and then a cactus, then I'm going to do my Hero Festival pull. I'm also eating a turkey burger since I just drove back five something hours from Miami today and got home and I'm starving. How'd your hero fest go? Really, I freaking needed a cactus. 50% chance to have a cactus show up, none show up. Mm. I will answer that question after I do these catches I need, and I'll go back to the airship and double check it. You're saving up for, you're saving up for what? A, a dragon grab bag package? What dragon grab bag package? A dart. Okay. Yeah, I was going to say, it's like, I know I haven't been able to play much recently, but I would have been really surprised if they had a dragon grab bag package. Okay, so let me let me ask this before I even look at it. What do you want to use the dark grab bag package for? Go 
Because I'll tell you, for my purposes, I have no need for any uh, the dark or the light um, grab bag. Not that I don't have them, but they're not worth it for me to spend 2,000 astrogems. That's that's about three and a half, ten plus one pulls to get a three-star dark unit. Yeah, but what are you going to use that dark unit for? Because it is, it's not even a four star, it's a three star unit. Now I can see if you really want to be a completionist and want to get as many co uh, complete summons as possible buying it. Okay, let me do one more map. I need one cactus. No, I, and I understand. And if that's if that's what your goal is, then yeah, then it would be worth it. Sorry, got a piece of lettuce stuck between my teeth. Strictly based on the math and the astrogems that you're going to be getting out of it for what you put into it, it's not worth it as a unit to do it. But if you're trying to do the completionist route, then yeah. BB. All right, so I got my cacti. Doing this mainly because I was trying to get more space in my inventory. Now you might ask, why am I catching things to make more space? And it's because I need to evolve up some things so I can free up the space total. So I needed to catch some things so I could actually do that. But I actually pulled a variance out of that, so that's cool. How many astrogems do you currently have, Panda? Oh, I feel much better after actually eating some food. All right, so Astrogide, I'm gonna take a look at the darkness in just a second. Oh, you know what, that's the first one of the watery guys I've caught. That's funny. I haven't completed going through and doing these because I've had so little time. Um, all right, let me do the mergers real quick. So we've got, what, I think it's a dark.
dark snail. Sorry, I just think of these guys as snails. Um, it probably really doesn't matter because I'm probably not going to keep either of them, so we'll just go ahead and merge those guys up. Coyotes is what I view these guys as. They're coyote is the oriental vegetable. All right, I actually grab that first. Let's see, we got one on here. All right, so there's a dark. We'll throw the variant on that one. All right, so let's go ahead and make that dark one, because then that'll at least complete him off. There, and we'll use huh, both of them are already variant talents. That's pretty funny. All right, so we'll use that one. Ah, uh, that thing looks absolutely horrible. Uh, and I do not like the stats at all, so I made it. It is completed. I should now get rid of him. <laughs> I got a single fruit from getting him. That's funny. But he, on the other hand, was most certainly worth going up to three, because he's worth 120 astrogems. All right, so the grab bag, dark, all dark. Three star. I'm just going to see if I think it's even useful at all. I, again, I think I've looked at them earlier and I don't believe that they, I thought they had any real use. I mean, whoops. Hello, Papaya. Oh my gosh, my cats are taking turns coming over. Hello. Hello. Goodbye. All right, 34,000 hit points, mediocre attack, horrible defense, horrible recovery, horrible. A hit point aggressor, though, the attack for the unit doesn't matter. It is a hit point aggressor, so that's nice. You got to be able to boost its maximum hit points up. Uh, and being able to give, so a, a hit point a set, a hit points aggressor shield unit for dark is actually nice. The problem with this is dark has already a lot of shielders. Um, Dark Hannah is a shielder, right? We've got um, Dark Cupid is a shielder. Um, there's, I think there's someone else that was a Dark Shielder too. So 1609. I mean, yeah, you could you could save up to get it. Um, so actually, yeah, you know what? Having, I take it back. So out of all of them. The hit point aggressor with a shield, so basically a healing shielder, hit point aggressor, probably is going to be a nice unit to put in. If you're able to EVO 3 it. Um, to do that, you obviously have to have caught a lot of grab bags. Uh, you would need to catch 15 grab bags in order to pull off the one, two, three, four. I've got like four of them because, I, again, I have not had a lot of time to play. So. Don't know if I'll have enough to be able to do anything like that or not for myself anyway. Uh, did I do the? I did do the quests. Let me do the bats. Bat, 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 bat. Oh well, then yes. If you don't have them, then that three star most certainly will be worth it for you um, because it will be giving you a shield for your dark unit, a heal for your dark unit, um, and a hit point aggressor for dark, which, I, I mean, let's face it, there I don't think there are any other hit point aggressor types. The dark, the dark rabbit girl might be a hit, she might be one. The dark Chloe, I think, is a hit point aggressor. Um, no, she's a courageous striker. It could be a different type of unit. But no, I, it could be useful for you. I mean, it, uh, honestly, in theory, it could be useful for me, but I'm not sure if I'm going to be willing to drop that many on her. Uh, 
Um, yeah, I'd use mine to just to do the fire, water, wood versions of them, I think. So I don't believe I'm going to have the spares to do that myself. Unless I get really lucky on a lot of catches or a lot of shards. Um, but shard, normally, had I, had I, you know, lots of time, um, I would easily have had enough to be able to pull it off. Without that, I don't know. Actually, do buying the dark one, though, gives you three... I think it gets you three hits, three more anyway. It's like the dark one and three others. So you can immediately Evo to it. Um, is that right? That's the fire. So for 990, you get four of them. But that's not the one you're trying to shoot for. You're going for... Skip. Back. Shop. Close. You're going here. Yeah, so you actually get four total because you get a fire, water, wood with it. Yeah, no, I, I, I remember it. I just went to the wrong place to start with. So, yeah, I mean, that's 300,000 pays for the evolution. Um, Honestly, maybe not a bad deal to go with it for the hit point aggressor part. Um, it could be a nice, a nice healer type for a dark titan type team. Heck, it could be a nice unit for level eighty of the um, Tower of Chaos as well. Uh, a dark healer, hit point aggressor, so it's going to be throwing fairly good damage. Um, yeah, that maybe is possible. All right. But now that I'm actually doing some pulls, because that's what I was planning on doing for me. Um, I don't remember what the variant skill is. I'll have to go back in there and look. By the way, I like the suspense, so I go through these one at a time. Last time it took me 8,000 Astro Gems to get one five-star unit. Oh, huh. Funny. I actually needed a wood Loki. So that's amusing. Because I burned my Evo 3 wood Loki because I didn't think I would ever have a use for him. And then they made the Evo 3 Loki the required meld. Oh, on a fire sand? <laughs> Funny. So I just got like two out of nine ingredients necessary towards making the new five star unit, I think. I'll look at the variant skill after I get out of this mode. Or after I do this pull. I might do two pulls though, because I can do two pulls before I run out of space and have to go to my inventory anyway. Five star maybe on the first? No, nope, not a five star on the first try. Unfortunate. And variance is going to be. A four star, that's nice at least. Well, I've got lots of wild things, so unfortunately. Well, I got three four stars, so that's not bad. All right, let me hit one more time and then I'll go look at the variant skill for it. Oh, nice. I've gotten variant five stars, but it's incredibly rare for that to happen. My cat is giving me like this scare. I'll be right back. What do you want?
my cat is a firm believer in catnip and she hadn't had any for several days. So now she's over there getting high on catnip. What uh, five star variant did she get? Um, the two that I've ever gotten, I got a fire Sanjang variant um, and I got a fire Valkyrie variants. No, yeah, fire, my variant five stars Fire Odin is a variant for me. Fire Sanjang and Fire Valkyrie are my variants. All right, so there's two wood banshees so far today. Yeah, the Valkyries are really nice for the variants. Um, they really can up. Actually, you know what? I tell you what, I don't have a variant Valkyrie. I fought people with variant Valkyries, but I don't have one. They give you the resistance bonus, I think. Well, this has not been a very good pull for this one. Two Wendigos in a row, though that's amusing, considering they're currently catchable, sort of. So a couple of four stars there. All right, so um, I was going to look at the variant grab bag real quick. So let's go do that because I got a grab bag right here. Uh, uh, so, okay, recovery, not really the greatest. Although I guess if you have the dark one and you had it as a variant in the lead and you didn't have a better skill, it would mean it would heal more when it did its heal and shield on units. I mean, it's not the great, it's not something to, that you should really be spending a lot of money over astrogen wise or otherwise to try getting a hold of, is sort of what my point is. Uh, what else do I select? I don't need that. Three of those. For the wood wendigo, let's make that to an Evo 2 wood wendigo. Actually, I don't even need to pull that many because I've got two water ones already. I just need to pull one. So we're going to pull that out. We're going to go to the wood wendigo. We're going to tag him over. I honestly don't need to spend the money to do that part right now. Just toss them into storage. And the water, water guy, I think that's who I need to keep. Let me check. Because I'm looking for certain units I need to keep. So, yep, need to keep him. And I should keep the fire sand wraith, I guess. Although, let me actually see what I have left of those things. I can summon four of those up as it stands right now, so that's not a big problem. Crab guys, I can do three, two crabs. Okay. All right. Monsters. Hey, Voodoo. I'm doing all right. I'm working on doing my summons. 
because today is really the first day chance I've had to do so. Release. Oh, I've got a step back. All right, I need to look at my kinds. My Pegasus. I've got, <laughs> been trying to get a lighter dark still, so I can make an Evo 3, and that hasn't happened yet. Um, so I've got currently. Let me toss him across because I don't need to keep him in there since I'm going to hang on to him. Let me keep him. So I've got one, two, three, four, four stars that I need to melt off. I guess the fire sand wraith I'll probably just need to hang on to for the moment. Voodoo, how did your pulls go? Uh, I am just now doing the festival. So this is me actually having time to sit down and do it for the moment. How about yourself? Did you get anything? You spent 14k and got two? Generally, I won't do this festival unless I have at least 8,000, because it generally takes me about 8,000 astrogens before I get a single 5-star to show up. You have three water balronas? Wait, how many water balronas are you going to have? I've got a single that I've ever gotten. So I've and I only just recently got the one I have. So I'm happy I finally got a balrona that's a water balrona. Oh, I got a Hannah. Sweet. I actually needed a Hannah. Even better, it's a very ancient Hannah. I'm going to go deal with that right now. Just give me a moment. Where is the Hannah that I have sitting in the window? I should pull the Banshee out. I don't need to keep it there. My Evo 2 Hannah, which is now unfortunate because I realize, well, I need a Hannah, I need three more Hannahs. <laughs> I don't think I had any, I've got the wood one over here. Am I being tired? I'm probably going to scroll right past it and miss it. Yeah, oh no, yeah, it is, okay, so it is there. So I guess we'll just toss you over into storage right now. But I'm so happy I got that Hannah. Let's make it closer to making that dark one. All right, so. Oh, <laughs> you see what I'm doing? I'm doing one or two pulls and then I'm switching and, and doing inventory clearing. 
So I, I feel you tremendously with your HANA shortage or your HANA, your storage issue. I certainly feel that. I'll make it bulky. Bulky can go away. Summon. Rebirth. Oh, you wait. You needed the Anus or you killed Anus? I'm assuming you meant to catch them, not kill them. All right, summon. I did on my drive back up from uh, oops, not summon, shop, special shop. My drive back up from Miami today, I used about 550 energy and was just doing Starstone runs because I couldn't really spend the time doing anything else since I couldn't afford to pay attention to what was going on on my phone. As at least, at the very least, one or two people died on the road today on the way back up because they had a helicopter literally in the road trying to take off or land i'm not sure which but it was actually in the road at this front of an accident and then the accident on this was a turnpike so like an interstate went on for about eight miles of everybody just sitting in their cars not being able to do anything fortunately for me it was on the south side going direction and i was going north so i wasn't backed up but somebody died in that wreck and they were trying to airlift somebody to a hospital to get them you know, not another casualty. So yeah, I felt pretty crappy when I saw that as I drove by. Two sea stars in a row. Wonderful. Looks like this is going to be a really dud of a draw. Another Tigger. Well, Tiggers I just melt. I don't bother keeping them, so. An easy melt choice. I need a gene, though. I'm still trying to finish my um, Evo 3 dark gene. And several genes. They're just not showing up. Hey, it's another variant of this. Um, pretty sure all my succubi are already variants, though. Let me see. Fire for sure. <laughs> Fire for sure already is. Water is. Pretty sure my wood succubus is also. Although she might be sitting in storage right now. Let's find out. Yeah, she's also very all right. Well, store you for maybe maybe during the next month's next month maybe during next month's clan festival they'll actually have a unit that actually has a variant ability that I actually want to try getting. Yeah, I I understand that. <laughs> I really do. Um, and since I was the only one in the car, it, it sort of meant I could I could tell it to auto restart it and let it run the twenty runs, and that was it. I could not afford to do anything else with stuff because that would have been would have been stupid. Uh, all right, so we shall release those guys. A little bit more astrogens, not a very good set of releases. 
I've got one, two, three units I can melt. So another Pegasus. Another chance for lighter dark Pegasus. I have summoned so many Pegasi and I've not gotten any lighter darks on that, which is very sad. One, two, three. Oh, I I don't expect I'll need to run it for a very long while. I just I'm not getting a lot of um, units to up to level 60 at this point. So, Water Pegasus. I mean, let's, at, at a quick look, just to keep, see where I'm at. Um, actually, I know what I can do. So, I've got a level 50 water unit on the map. Is it here? Oh, I probably should put a stone on her. So I've got 109 high stones at the moment. Doesn't really matter as long as it's a protection gem. Okay. Actually, no, maybe give her one that's... Aha! Oh, <laughs> I've kept that one because it's nice resistance with crit. I guess you're just going to get the scrappy gem, just so you have the complete set. You're not running around without a set anymore. And that'll free up a jump slot. Oh, do I actually have skill? I do have a couple skill books. Yeah. It's actually been a bit since I've taken a peek and s to see if I actually have gotten any skill books I need to apply to anybody. Mm. I do have a couple I can put on my Sphinx and on my Sura. And then I, I actually have several skill books. Okay, so I'll deal with skill books later. Continue my festival. I'd love to get one of her. I actually, some people were poo pooing her, but I think she's got some really, really nice skills for several of her colors. So I'd be, I'd be very happy to get one. Again, there are definitely some haters on it, but I think she could be a very, very good unit. Oh, the Anus. Yeah, the last, the last couple of four stars I've ended up killing. I, I was, and I've been trying to hunt the elephants. Um, they, when, they, when they do show up, I've been murdering them instead of catching them, though, so that's been unfortunate. Um, I actually did need another Cupid, so that's useful. I think I'm making a wood Cupid at the moment. Because I haven't made an Evo 3 Wood Cupid yet. So, so far, the only good unit on this pull has been the Wood Cupid or the Fire Cupid. Um, it's only good because I'm working on making another. Oh, but I did get a Hannah, so that's good. So, I need two more Hannahs? to make my Dark Cannon Evo 3. No, the Draca has been the only one that they've done. All right, I do have enough space to do another hit worth of this, so we're gonna go ahead and hit another Oh, this is good. I actually had not gotten over 600 crystals yet this month. So doing the Hero Festival will get me there and I'll be able to get my three gleams. Not sure what I'm going to use them for. Or even if I should get them at the moment at all. Yeah, I'm not sure I'm going to hatch them up yet. Oh, yeah, I mean, they're, they have not announced any others. Um, 
They've now brought the Draca back twice, about six months apart. I expect, and I actually, I actually called it for when they did it. I said that they would do it over the holidays, and they did. Um, I expect that the Draca will be brought back a third time, probably around May or so. And they'll do it just like they would do the the pulls here. Like the every every time they put a new four star unit in or they repeat a four star unit, it's in for three festivals. I expect they'll do the Draca for a total of a year and a half. And then after that they'll introduce a new five star rebirth unit. That's my expectation. iDrive. I'm actually recording stuff to iDrive, so I gotta make sure. Oh, I got another Cupid. Cool. Alright, Misha. Yeah, I'm, I'm also, like I said, all sorts of running into space issues. And I am not going to pay for a rental airship. $27 to rent an airship for a month is not what I'm going to be doing. Because then if it ever goes off rental, everything becomes locked out until you pay it. Basically, you, basically it's like your car getting repossessed. Everything in your car has been locked away until you pay the repossession fee, and then you can get it back out again. Yeah, that was a really horrible set of pulls. All I got was the Cupid out of that. All right, so we're going to go by kinds, and then I'm going to go to Cupid. I grab the Hannah also. It's because I've got to manage these inventory of, of guys. All right, recent. Oh, actually, whatever, let's go by water. Water. Actually, I can pull my other cupid out and toss them into it. Nice. That's a uh, all the colors of the cupid that are base, which is pretty funny. Yeah, I mean, I, that's what I would expect. I expect they'll do the Dracula one more time. But it, again, they've been doing it at about six month intervals. And like I said, I, I expect that's going to be, continue to be the case. Um, oh, I need to go to storage. And then Wood Cupid can get pulled out. Take this by recent. Release those. Wood Cupid is the one I need to make, so we're going to go to wood, combine that in. I only need, I think, two more Cupids now to finish this Evo 3 Wood Cupid off. So I'm going to toss you and you. Would keep it across this three eyes. All right, that's relatively perfect. Shop. Oh, so Voodoo, which um, five star contract did you go with?
Come on, five star. Nope. Denied. Um, also Odin. Um, the Odin for that, and I'm pretty sure her ult's the defense break, which was also just as important to me. Ooh, well, I did not need another Kira, so she's a melt. I figured I would get the most use out of the Odin. Wow, this has been a real another really bad set of pulls. I've gotten a single four star out of this set. And the three star variant. Oh, sorry, two four stars out of it. I got the Leo. Might be working on building a water Leo. Let me take a peek and double check that. By cons. Looks like working on building a Leo. Honestly, there's no reason to keep those two in there. They can come out. I can melt them, free up a little bit of space. Speaking of the Anus, I've got Anus all sorts of ways. The Dark Siren is nice. The Water Siren I like better. Oh, I guess I am working on a Leo. Maybe? I got the Wood one built. Let me pull those guys out. I might not have the Water one built yet. If I don't, I'll start building it. Yeah, I guess I'll start building a water Leo. So, push on. Square, square dot. I like it. We'll go with that one. And we'll toss them back into storage. We'll go back over here and we will go to summon and we'll try again for lighter dark Pegasus. No, we can do that because I've got units right here that can be used. Yeah, I've. <laughs> did, you, did you notice that the majority of them are, are variants? So there's no. I don't like the variant skill on the Pegasus. There's, I got a dark Pegasus! Yay! Finally, I got a Dark Pegasus. There's no point for me, to, and that's actually out of the ones I would have wanted. That's probably that's the one I really wanted to get. I I wouldn't mind the light one, but the dark one I'm okay with. So finally, I got a Dark Pegasus unit, one of the two. All right, but did it get any decent sockets? Let's find that out. Thanks. I've <laughs> noticed. If you didn't notice, I have been trying to get one for a bit. Um, did I put a? Pegasus into storage already? No. To sort by kinds. Fire. Wood. <laughs> uh, defense break, or I'm looking at the primary skills. Uh, 
pull those guys out. Those will be my Evo 3 units for it. I got a square on it. I can be happy. I, I've gotten I've gotten so many dark units recently that had no squares whatsoever on them. All right, yeah. So that one, that one, melts. All right, and then hit up a few more. So I'm down about three thousand Astro gems so far, trying to get. Any five star, like I said, I usually don't pull unless I have eight thousand minimum. Oh, for the, uh, I'll look again after I go through this. I want to say it was silence on his alts, but that might have been the light one because I looked at both of them real quick back and forth. Alright, well, I think that's so far no four stars on this set. Six in. Light was done and 10%. Okay, so I think he was a silence on his alts. I've actually fought some teams, some high level teams that have a light Pegasus mixed in. And it it's doing fairly well now. I did not do very well in my uh, PvP matches this week. Um, Mainly because I just haven't had time. <laughs> so I got over a thousand points total, and that was about it. All right, so I got a Cupid, so that's useful at least. Looks like the Cupid might be the only thing useful out of this set. And a three-star variant, which is Mermaid. Oh no, I just I did get the Wild Fang. Oh no, it was increased critical hit damage by 30%. So he's an, he's a personal SP booster. And he does his own crit hit damage boost. 10% base, 100% damage boost on it. Uh, no skill books yet for him. Storage. Um, I need to pull out the water. Cupid. I'm trying to remember why I was saving the vampires. Was I building a different vampire somewhere? He is an Evo 2 water vampire, I think. Yeah. All right, I need to see if I need to build the Evo 3 water vampire. I think I do. But I was going to pull him out for the time being. Water Cupid, Evolution, throw him in. Yeah, it's, it's a 30, well, it's not, I wouldn't say it's a flat, but it's 30% crit damage boost, so it's on top of whatever your other crit damage boot, your crit damage is percentage-wise. So if you're doing 100 crit damage, you get an extra 30 crit damage on top of that. If you're doing 200 crit damage, you're getting 60 crit damage on top of that. Um, okay, so let me throw him back into storage. And then... Is that a fire yacht? I, I've got a lot of units that I was working on stuff, and now I need to check other things also. So, the Yaksha... Where are you hiding? Okay, so I do have a fire vamp already built. Looks like I was working on the water vamp. So 
where's the, I had two yakshas sitting in, okay, no, there was just two of them together, not another one built out yet. Got it. Recent. Actually, I need to be this where anyway, the spots. All right, I need to look at the water vampire. No, it's not because it says it says percentage after it. All right, so if you if you see the unit, right, increase critical hit damage by thirty percent. So that's a percentage. Yeah, so if you're doing a thousand crit hit damage, then it's increasing that damage by 30%. So you'd be doing 1300 critical hit damage. Uh, I need to look for a vampire's water damp. Okay, so I do need to do the water vamp, look at the fire yaksha. So that's the one that works in process. Yeah, so she's in process too. All right. So that said, over a pair of fires. I'm micromanaging my inventory by a lot. Oh, you know what? Why did I do... I've got a pair of Cura. Do I have a Cura that's not built yet? I'm trying to think now why I've got a Cura partially built. Unless I was working on another cure somewhere for some reason. I don't know, I might have started just building a second fire cure. Wait, how much coal did you use? 15,000 or 150,000 or 1.5 million? For me, it's always the astrogems that are the limiting factor. I've never, I've almost never run out of gold while doing a hero festival or a festival. It's always been the astrogems that limited me. 15, oh wow. How'd you spend 15 million gold? What did you even spend 15 million gold on? I can burn myself out when I do gem upgrades at discount discount once a month. But I've now gotten to the point that most of my gems are set, so I don't need to spend as much to do any more gem upgrades. Oh, that's a meltable Yuki. Uh 
That's that's still a lot of gold. Fifteen million was a crap load of gold to have spent. Didn't, you had like twenty million. If you were who I saw broadcasting yesterday or the other day, you had like twenty million gold at the start, though, didn't you? Or was that somebody else? I actually got three four stars this run. A variant Yuki. Well, okay. Hi. Okay. Can we can we see a theme here? Wood Yuki, fire Yuki, variant water Yuki. That that's me is establishing some sort of crazy theme. I don't actually think I have the wood Yuki built up. Maybe I'll actually just use that and build a wood Yuki now. Just because I keep getting so many of the stupid things. <laughs> I I think isn't she the one that's a uh, no, I have built her previously. Yeah, she's the one that's a double recovery down. And it's a horrible chance to even land it. So there's a reason I don't use her. Alright, well, I know what I'm gonna use her for. Hello, Yuki's. You're going to come and join me in fun time over here. And you. And you. And you. Yeah, I, Yuki's show up for me a lot. They really, really do. I, I've got... I have Dark... Is it Dark? No, I've got Dark Banshee. I've got Fire, Water, and Wood Yuki all at Evo 3s. Fire Yuki at Evo 4, because I super Evo the Fire Yuki. Alright, so that one was enough to get the Pegasus in play, I believe, at this point. Evolution. 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 Oh, he actually has blue eyes. Look at that. Oh, it looks like it actually looks like he's wearing a hat with the way the hair thingy is on his head. Yeah. All right, and then you, and you, and you, and you, and you, and you. Actually, I've seen light Yuki's be very useful in some PvP matches. How is that? Ooh. My Little Pony Braids. Alright, neat. So I I at least have a new unit that I can work on leveling up. Because I was actually seriously running short on units to be able to level up. Go to storage. Recent. We're going to toss you and the variant across. So I can sit on them like good little eggs. And then we're going to work on melting the rest of the junk. actually gets me under where it's releasing Poop. all right so I'm now actually ooh, that's right because I didn't need the three I've spent over f probably about 4500 I probably spent about 5,000 Astro gems at this point because I've been earning some Astro Gems with other stuff going on at the same time. No five stars yet. I do recognize that this is the long way to go about doing the hatching. Another Wood Wendigo though. And this is the turn I get all Wendigos. Oh, 
Wow. All right. That's at least three Wendigos right now, maybe four on this one set. Yeah, I actually needed a Neza, so that's useful. And the variant is going to be a three-star Wendigo because I got so many Wendigos already this run. Oh, it's a four-star something. Four-star Sura. All right. Well, I can use the Neza. This is, again, the long way to be doing things. Might be able to use the Sura also by kinds. So I got a Neza and a Sura. There's Lord Vanessa. Yeah, because that's an Uber too. Pop you out. And a Sura. I start building or was I just using the Suras for scrap? I think I was just using the Suras for scrap. Alright, but I do have a fire Neza to toss that. Oh, I thought you needed three Neza. So was I oh no, was, I'm working on building the water Neza, is what it is. And to build the water Neza, I need to have more Nezas to put into it to make the water Neza. Voodoo, hmm. have you seen or heard any from Kahulami? Because I have not heard nor seen anything for quite a while. A little bit of gold. Uh, we have another variant, so we'll just toss them over. I want to check my Wendigos and make sure if I need to keep the water ones separate. I need to get more of those guys. All right, so excellent. Oh, I'm actually glad that, by the way, that this dude is able to be made now. The um, the light version of her. I need just a few more to be able to finish making it, which is nice. All right, so recent wood evolution. Um, did I get rid of the fire? Huh. I might have. Oops. Well, whatever. I'll just leave them there. I'll get some more to show up. I hadn't actually picked up my stuff yet from the end of the week. Grab those. Special shop. Summit. No, I, I understand. Hey, five star! Yay! I did it in under 8,000. And it's a wood belt Rona! Yay! It's a belt Rona. 
I can be happy regardless of what type of Balrona that it was. Because any Balrona for me is a good Balrona at this point. Because it means I got an egg. I'm just going to skip the rest of this because I want to get some water. And there's probably nothing else of use. No, I actually got... Yeah, not bad. Alright, let's get that notification. Grab the egg. Go there. Go here. Go here. Go here. Oop, I have to freaking get it out. Okay, just give it to me. Don't send it to my mailbox. Alright, so I, now I'm going to keep you in suspense because... I ran out of water, and I'll get some water before I hatch my eggs. I'll be right back. Okay. Didn't take that long to get it, but I needed it. All right, let's hatch this pretty egg up and see what we get. Wood bass. Well, I already have bass. So I guess this lets me get another bass as well. That's just that's too bad. I was hoping to get one of the new units and I did not. But that's alright. They're five stars. So I can toss them over into storage for the time being. The Loki, I'm just gonna toss them straight across. The Cura, for whatever reason, I was building another fire one, so we're gonna pull that out and melt it in. Again, I don't remember exactly why I was doing the Cura, but... Oh, might have been because she had three squares. <laughs> that, that might be why I was doing her. Storage. So her and her to go back across. Flip. Recent. Scroll. Storage. Recent. You. You. Release. Release. challenge you actually so I don't forget because I might because I'm tired we're gonna like pull him out and we're going to feed him so I can finish my daily level up feed him all the freebie food good enough daily is now complete feed 500 times since it was free makes that easy and restock since we have four o'clock grab 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 Loki grab grab down there all right and can I get back to back five stars that would be awesome I have actually not done enough pulls to ever get two units two five stars in one set yet I've never had enough Astro Gems to do it. Um, if I got really lucky, it could happen, but I'd have to get really lucky.
Why are you grabbing even the three star pieces? What do you mean grabbing them? A vampire. Another Neza, nice. You're buying them even though I'm releasing every single one of them. Oh. Um, well, I mean, you have to buy them. If you want to get the 10 plus 1 with the guaranteed variant and the bonus, basically, this is giving you a free summon. Every time you do a 10 plus 1, you get a free summon. Whereas if you did 10 of one time pulls, you would have to spend 660 diamonds to match this one free summon and you're guaranteed that variant. So I always I always buy the 10 plus ones. If I'm not understanding what you're meaning, it's because I'm tired. I slept very badly last night at a hotel. Um, oh, oh, oh. Okay. Um, because because under quests, uh, daily, no, nope, challenges, do, do, do. 30 variants via rebirth, and summon 30 astromons using soul stones, right? So three, the three star units take what? 30 to do a single summon. So if I can buy five of their shards for 10,000, that's okay. I'm going to do math here. Calculator. So I'm buying five of their shards for 10,000, right? Which means I'm spending 50,000 to buy. Uh, wow, my brain really does not want to work right now because I'm tired. Five of their shards for 10,000. 30 of them gives me a summon. It takes 6 times 5, 6 times 10,000, so it's 60,000. Sorry, my math is broken, so it's 60,000. 60,000 in gold to do a, a summon. 30 summons, 60,000 times 30. For 1.8 million in gold, I'm guaranteed to get 100 Astro Gems back. Looking at that, that's maybe not the greatest, but whatever. I'm, I'm, maybe I'm doing my math wrong. I could be doing my math incorrectly. But anyway, you can get every 30 Astro Man summons, you get 100 Astro Gems. And in general, I have gold to spare, and I don't have Astro Gems for, to spare. CCK, oh, that's true. You, have, you do have to spend the money to do the summon. But, again, in general, I have gold to spare, not astrogems to spare, because I can transfer into making astrogems, but I can't tran... You can, you can buy gold for astrogems, but that's stupid. Um, but getting astrogems for gold, that that's a process that you can spend the gold that you've earned to get astrogems without having to farm them other than just doing, you know, standard stuff, running maps, doing uh, gold dungeons for stuff. So that's that's why whenever I see, whenever I see those, I always buy them. It's because I know that I can do the summons to get to earn Astro Gems off of it. Sorry. Like I said, tired, so my brain is not running at optimal efficiency at the moment.
Well, that's true. Yeah, I mean, the two if you can get the two-star stuff, the Kilobet Dungeons, the two-star units, even more effective. Um, I just get bored and don't remember to do them as often as, as I probably should. But it would be, if I actually hit those dungeons every time I saw them pop up, um, especially when allies have them, because, you know, you fly through that, um, doing the summons nets you astrogems. Do I get a five-star there? Nope. Oh well. Oh, but I did get okay. So I'll actually go to get another nest up to Evo too. Get closer to put a I'll put a pip on the uh, water Neza. Hey, I got a Hannah. Nice. I need one more Hannah to make my dark Hannah to Evo three. I have not pulled a single gene. Not a single gene. Any of the pulls. I'm trying to finish the dark gene, and I can't finish it if I don't get any genes at all. Four pieces out of a dungeon? Four pieces... What do you mean four, four pieces of what? Oh, you mean four shards when you go into a dungeon? It's... You're guaranteed between one and three. Or is it one and four? Maybe it was one and four. Two being the most common, one being uncommon, three being pretty rare, and four being like basically getting a legendary, I guess. So yeah, you probably should have gotten some if you're doing them pretty religiously. Map. All right, so let me do the melts first and clear out all the chaff. Ah, 200,000 in gold from that set of releases. That's useful. All right, now back over to here. I know I've got the Neza to grab back again. The Neza and the Hannah uh, and the Vampire. them out and I'll go look for them. Oh, of course, there it is. The Neza is here. I oh, already do enough of the vampires that I have it pipped in. Hannah. All right, so Hannah, Revolution. I need one more Hannah. Vampires. And evolve him up. <laughs> then the Neza search by elements. I bet I just did 50 quests, or 100 quests. Back we go. Uh, evolution view. I need to pull the water Neza back out so I can put this into the water Neza. Actually, before I do that, I should probably confirm that the water Neza has not already been go to. Or not even the three. Water. Nope. 
All right. Cool. Monsters, storage, water, as a There's a all right, so I can throw the Nezas back across. You know, I think I've got the water vampire. Yep. Okay. Water Vampire first. Double check again, I didn't do the Vampire yet because I don't want to waste that tremendously. Water Vampire. All right, storage. Fire units are removed. The water units needs to go. You and you and you and you. Actually, melting the Pegasus into the Dark Pegasus helped me on my storage issues. So I've got more storage space available now because that was the five of them sitting and they were taking a good chunk of my space up. Oh, oops, didn't want to go there. Back to here. Back to summons. The summoning will continue. No, I've not. I, again, I haven't had a lot of time. So I haven't been rushing doing all the story quests yet. Yeah, so I've, I've, I'm not rushing doing them. I can, beating that is not something that's hard to do. I just haven't had the time to do it. That said, beating that one probably would be a good idea for me to do so because it would actually let me, um, I think I have to find Nez to finish this one off. Yeah, I haven't finished finding Nez yet. That would give me the extra 100 astrogems, but that'll be a nice set of 100 astrogems when I have no gems left at the end of all the summons. So it's not a big deal for me to finish that off. Um, Capture Legendary, Capture Super Rare, Free Summon, and Special Shop. Oh, I'm supposed to do 20 Free Summons. Oh, wow. So if I don't do the sixth, the 60 cost at a time, it makes it harder to get that. I Okay, I'm not. This one here, the Do Free Summon and the Special Shop, I'm not a fan of that at all. Because in order, they're making it, in order to get the Legendary Secret Egg, You've got to do it at least 20 free summons in the shop. And this is running through March 11th. Okay, well, at least it, it should cover one more festival. It will cover the clan fests. But I'm still not a fan that they're making you do that many to get the results for it. To complete that, okay, so some sometimes they put in things that I don't think are fair. Oh, you know what, maybe that is considered a free summon also. Again, as I said, I've been tired. So, yeah, it probably does count these also. Never mind. I, I'm operating on about three hours of sleep, so yes, my brain did not function and pick that up right away. But yeah, you would be right. The free summons would count as well. Be right back. It's another Sura.
Yeah, I, yeah, I'm not a fan of ones that take a really long time. Like, I mean, some of them I can understand. They want people to not, how to put it? They want people to not be finished with like their big events that go for a month in the first two days. So I can understand them, you know, sometimes having things that take longer to finish. I am really curious as to what they're going to do with the quests that you're supposed to be able to send your astromons on. Um, how that's going to end up working. They put they announced that in one of their long patches they're going to have a part where you could send your astromons out to go on a quest. Um, they would then be unavailable to you during that time while they were gone. I played a different game a long time ago that had something like that. You could send your, your minions out for questing purposes for you. Um, so I'm curious to see how they actually implement that in this game. Well, I think that's going to guarantee me getting the uh, last Pegasus I need for the bonus Astro Gems from that. Papaya girl. Hi. Bye. in the boxes and so I use it computers boxes will go form to the function of what I'm doing. Yeah I'm hoping I mean I'm hoping when you send it you pay like a little bit of gold or whatever and then they have a chance to come back with gems or astro gems would be nice. Yeah, a couple four stars in a row there. That's right, they actually did a patch for my 3D printer yesterday or two days ago. They put out an update for it, but in order to actually update it, I got to turn it on, got to turn the laptop on, got to download the stuff. All right, that's like four four stars on this run. Be nice if it tapped it. Tapped it off with a five star. Unlikely, but it would be nice. Three star variant. Well, I got a lot of four stars out of that. So I really, one, two, three, four, four stars on that run. So I can't complain about that that badly. But, oh, oh, nope, wrong spot. Summon, Pegasus. One, two, three, two, Mr. Green Jolly Giants. Papaya, papaya, papaya. My cat wanted me to give her cat food.
I'm actually working on downloading my drivers I need, so give me just a moment. Firmware drivers stuff. Older laptops take time to run. Oh, and it's a green Pegasus. Oh, it actually crashed on me anyway. So uh, let me restart it since it crapped out on that Pegasus summon. Because it's downloading on that laptop, it does not want to let the laptop actually do anything else useful. Good. We'll resume that. Oh, what's do you need to borrow a unit? Would that help you out on it? copying some files right now so that's why I'm sort of tied up while I get this set up to copy.
All right, so I need to tell these to copy. And then I'm going to go to this letter. And we're going to make a folder. 3D, 3D print files. Go into that file and paste those up. Hey, blood, I got a wood balrona followed by a wood bass for the egg. That's what I've gotten so far. So I've got some more to go through. I'm hoping to get at least one more, but see if that happens or not. Been working on doing updates for my 3D printer. Hey, Abyss, this is actually my second wood bast. So I'm not sure if I'm going to use her for a feeder into my one of my wood bass, or in my existing wood bass, or one of my other bass, or if I will make her in her own right. Um, all my bass, all my bass are currently at Evo two. If I used her as, and I made all the other ones feeder units, then I would have an Evo 3 singular bast. I'm not sure I want to do that. I think they're more valuable to me separately than they are combined into one right now. Actually, the water stand thing is not bad. It's effectively a light Nike, but a Sanzang, so a water unit. Hey, there's a four star going on. No, not going on five star. I did, I did though manage to get a dark Pegasus. So I was very happy. I finally got, I hadn't gotten a light or a dark unit yet for that. And so I was happy I got the dark. So I now have an Evo three uh, dark Pegasus. Singular four star on that run. Not a great run. Oh, my inventory stuff. So I guess I need to go to my inventory and deal with it. Monsters. Storage, recent. Oh, it didn't even. Okay, it dropped all of them in my temporary storage. That's annoying. I could have put some in here. That would have been far less annoying had it done that for me. All right, so I'm going to pull one of him out. And pretty sure I need to pull the fire Yaksha out. Plummet. Fire Yaksha. Go ahead and make him. Evolution. Yeah, I've got very similar. So fire Yaksha, that one was a variant, as long as it doesn't end up being a variant. And it won't. Do both of them at the same time. So she's going back in the Loki, Pegasus, him are going in. And 
And let me go, let's get both of those. Yeah, I understand what, what what you're doing and why you're doing it. So you guys are going to give me a dark or a light unicorn. You. And you. So I toss the unicorn back across. Recent. I don't think I have any other unicorns to meld that into right now. Oh, you were looking at the Anus. Uh, my elements. Yeah, that's one, two, three, four, five variant Anus and one normal Anus. Yeah, I don't have any more of the unicorns right now. I've got the wolves, but not the unicorns. Not sure why I'm keeping the wolves, but I have them. So if I ever do end up wanting to make a Shiva, I'll have plenty of wolves for that. Yeah, you're lucky. I didn't get the light, the light Pegasus, so all I got was the dark. So un unlikely at this point that I'll be getting the um, light Pegasus out of that. No, that's nice, Blood Reaper, that you got the doubles. I'm I'm trying. I have I had ten thousand Astro Gems to start with, so I am also attempting to get two if I can, although I'll probably just as usual end up with just one. Uh, and this is with me skipping clan fest, because I just if I don't do that I cannot get the Astro Gems to even have a good shot at getting just the one. Alright, so melt, 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 melt. Melt, 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 release. Elements. I got a Nike and I've got I think I have a, I have a wood Nike being worked on. I mean actually double check that I actually need a wood Nike prior to completing that. Oh, wood. I do already have the wood Nike, so uh, was it a water Nike that I was wanting to build? Or am I just wasting that by not doing it or doing it when I shouldn't? Let's see. Ah, that's what I was working on building was a water cura. I have the wood, I have the water. Do the fire in it? Or am I just being silly and building a Nike when I didn't need to? Oh, okay. Yeah, it was a fire. Alright, so fire Nike. It's currently Evo 2. Those are both Evo ones that will let me get that Nike up to an Evo two, and the Cura. I was making a water Cura, which is why I made that fire Cura. Knew there had to have been a reason why I did it. 
So let me go to water and make that. Fire Nike is going to be. Uh, I would have thought it would have been right there. Did I not pull it out? Oh no, it's not. It's the the other way around. I'm still working on going through. I'm just I've been doing inventory management every step of the way. So that's why I'm still going through my Astro Gems. I didn't I didn't start my pulls until today when I got home from my drive from I had a long drive up from Miami. And I did not do that. So I'm do this one. And then it's making the fire. Make really sure of that because I'm tired and I don't want to melt it into the wrong one. Okay, yes, the fire. Oh, that's true. The light golem would let me go towards the new one, wouldn't it? Yeah, that is true. They would let me build the light golem, so that actually would let me build the dark golem, which would let me build the dark animal. The, okay, I'll tell you what the problem is. The problem is, when I build this Nifa, I don't want to get rid of her, so <laughs> it's going to take me even longer, because I'm I'm actually, I'm actually really close to being able to build this Nifa into an Evo 3. And, and I want to keep her just because I think she looks funky, and I don't want to melt her. So when I build her, she's going to be kept. Which means I'll have to build a second one of her to actually do the, um, the light thingy, the light person. Because her... Hang on, where is her little... She's one of the bosses on one of the maps. And I've been wanting, I wanted to be able to catch her. Basically, she's, she's like like it's a seraphim angel, right? So I wanted to keep that. And I like that she's a crit hit damage unit, and I think she's an attacker. She is. So, a decent attack for a four star unit. Anyway, we'll see. I, I'm not that far from being able to finish her off. I need like one, is it one more unit I think to finish her? I need, yeah, I need to make one more of her. Once I have one more of her made from the unicorn penguins, and to do that, I need uh, the unicorns, and then I'll be able to finish it off. It's just taking time to get there. Yeah, I mean, I like I like how it looks. So I, because it was, it's the boss on one of the maps, and it's a pain in the ass boss. Um, it's the dark version was the one that was the pain in the ass boss, but I wanted to be able to make the light one. Anyway, back to summon. Okay, that space again. I've gotten a lot of meowings today. Sorry I haven't had a chance to broadcast for quite a while. I've just been so incredibly busy. Hey, blind man. Howdy. I'm not leaving. I'm just standing up for a second because I gotta have some stuff and run install programs. Is that 
Give me just a second as I get this other program running over here. Produce the Windows installation program. I guess I can actually do this wireless mouse. I can just take the mouse over here with me. It's been going really good. I've been very happy. Um, the coworkers are great. I've been enjoying it. Um, it's just taking, you know, a lot of time to go through everything. But I've been really enjoying it. How have you been, blind man? And blind, how's your Hero Fest been going? Or gone? I know almost everybody finished their Hero Fest before I did this time around because I just I haven't had the time other than right now to work on it. All right, so I've got that running. Another Victoria. Yeah, another Victoria for that. But I just made an Evo 2, which means she's a, a, a straggler at the moment. Because I'll need three more Vicks. All right, so not the best of runs for that. A single four star out of those. Uh, I mean, I if I wasn't using it to make a Victoria um, just for the the gem reward for the expo exploratory on it, then yeah, it would be a waste. Especially since I don't need any more Pegasus at the moment. I the thing is, I'd have to get a lot more of them to make them useful because I'd have to. In, how to explain it best? Unless you can do 15 four stars into the Pegasus all at the same festival, it's not worth putting any into the Pegasus because you're not getting the Astrogem bonus back. And yeah, you can craft the Nike, so she's not a big deal. But then any of that's like saying any of the four stars that you get on the maps are annoying because you're like, I just got a four star on the map, or I got a, you know. The same three star I'm always catching, I got it again and again. Like these monkey keys, I get lots of monkey keys. They show up a lot for me. I had one draw where I had like three Wendigos. And I had one draw where I had three of each color were they the Yukis. I had a fire, a water, and a wood Yuki all in the same draw. That was actually rather weird. Well, that's the thing. That's why you buy that's that's why I buy those shards is when you need to be able to get the last bit so that you can make sure you get the extra astrogem reward. So I always buy those shards when I see them and I can buy them. Another Victoria. Okay, well, now my Victoria doesn't have to feel lonely because she's got a friend. Let's see. It's going to be a three-star something. Nope, four-star something. A four -star. Speaking of Yukis, look, it's another Yuki.
All right, well, let me deal with a wave worth of these guys here. Monsters, recent, storage, I'm running out of, well, I'm not quite out of space yet, so that's good. So you're going to get tossed across, because I'll keep the, I'm, keep, I'm hanging on to the variants um, until next fest, and hopefully there'll be a worthwhile thing with variant ability for me to actually get a variant unit out of. Good. 30 astrogems, 100,000 gold. Eh, not the best set I've gotten out of that, but could have been worse. Problem is, I'm starting to run really, really, really out of space over there. As in, I've got like one spot left. But I've got decent space on this set, on this side. So. I can do I can do three more pulls, and then I've got a wrap for the pulls. <laughs> Next Lupin dungeon. Yeah, I have to wonder what his story mode is going to be. Who will he be trying to date this time? Or not date? Or whatever. Come on, five star. Come on. No, denied. Oh, well. Another Banshee. I finally got a gene. This is out of all the pulls I've done today. This is the only gene that I've had show up. I probably have had seven or eight Yuki's and that's the only gene that I've had show up. Now, speaking of Lupons, you've had to, you gifted me with the Lupon. Well, there's a lot of four stars on this set. Given the number of servers that I've just gotten, I might as well throw some. Yeah, I might as well throw them into. I think I need a server still, so. Might as well start making a server to eat up some of the space. Yeah, four. Alright, so, do I have any genes currently in my storage? Probably not. I've got a wood three star over here though. So I've got, this is a Evo 2. That's an Evo, all right, so you can come out because I can meld those two together. Yeah, damn it. <laughs> That's the only gene I currently have. So, so that gene needs to go in. Recent. That sir is going to come out. Was it this batch that I got the Nike? Or was it the previous batch I got the Nike? It must have been the previous batch. Alright, so you're going to come out. Uh, the low key is required. Probably should do this by kinds. Yeah, see, I've got her at Evo 2 right now, and I've got a, one already next to her waiting, 
So I do need to get some more. I actually guess I needed a lot more of them than I thought I did for those guys. But oh well. Loki, Loki, Loki. Although, damn it, because the wood Lokis are the ones that you need to keep, there's no point in taking both of them out. I need to keep that one in there. Always make more of them. Probably gonna just leave one in the inventory for right now of him. Yeah, you know, I actually probably do need to do something with this guy at some point. That was his problem. He was Mr. Triangle Man. He was all triangles all the time. All right, so we'll draw those. And it's light cosmos that you can catch. Dark cosmos you have to make or get from eggs. I've gotten a crap ton from eggs. I can get rid of the light cosmo because I don't use them. Oop, let me melt some guys off. Theory, I should keep him so I should pull him out just so I get the Astro Guide set up for that. Yes, they're in my inventory. So when the next the next weenie comes out, whoever the new four star is, and I'm hoping they have a decent variant ability, I'll have a chance to get a variant unit. That's why I'm keeping them in my stash. I I know they. It's probably going to be another weenie, but um, that's my goal. All right, where did you go, Mr. White Guy? Whatever, just search by element. So I'll I'll have a decent, I'll have two chances at 15% each just on the Anus alone, effectively. I think if I did my, my math, remembering that correctly. Pull you back across. All right, so wood, melt those together. The low keys. I'm pretty sure it was the wood low key I need to keep. Light. Yeah, it's wood Loki's. Uh, Dark Odin. She's going to be the one I'll get the most use out of, so that's why I went with her. You let's free up some space. Ah, that's what I need to check. Don't think I've done a fire sir to Evo 3 yet. And that'll help me save space. Do, do, do. I have not. Hey, thank you for the follow. Shout out to Killer Units. Thank you. Appreciate it. All right, so Fire Sura. Mm. 
Do you have to crit to get this stuff to work? No. Okay, so he can be relatively tanky or tanky ish. Means I don't need square slots for him. So he's not even going to have a square slot to start with. Awesome. Because I want the diamond slot on him. Um, festival continues. I'm not quite done with it. I'm, I'm doing mad inventory usage stuff at the same time as I go. Uh, I did get a dark pegasus though, so I'm quite happy with that. So I was able to make that an Evo 3. Um, I did get a wood Balrona and a wood um, Bast. I'm going to figure out what I'm going to do with the Bast because that's my second one. I could make an Evo 3 of any one of the primary Balrona element or, or uh, Bast elements, or I can keep them separate at Evo 2s, and I'm probably going to keep them separate. Because I think having more of them at the moment is going to be better. Although I might, I might drop my fire bast into one of my other bass. She's really only useful for PvP, and I've not used her at all for PvP. So Yeah, I mean that's that's the thing with her. She's really useful for a wood titan team. Well, you could start building a wood titan team around her. Actually I got a Yeti Defender, so that's good. I can build another unicorn now. <laughs> Well, I'm not really hunting for water yetis from eggs when I can catch the silly things. Fire when to go. Unit that I have no real super need for? That's the only four star out of this pull. Oh, wait, actually, you said you got another wood bass. That means you have one already, which means you have enough to form the basis of a team. So you got the, the kernel of a team going. All right, well, this is going to be my last poll because this is going to drop me down to 200 something. So um, I'm going to do what I did last time, which was on the last poll, I'm just going to auto right through the whole thing and maybe I'll get something useful out of it. Skip all. Nope, didn't work this time. That's all right. Um, but that did get Nezas, and I think that'll let me finish that Neza off. Let's see here. So we're going to get rid of. Rid of all those, release, get more. Man, I'm pretty sure I threw my light guy back. Toss the Neza back across. Did end up with another Nike. It's really is it to me it's really really sad I did not actually get any more than one gene and I needed four of them so I could actually make my uh, dark gene in Evo 3 and I only got like one Hannah or no I guess I get two Hannahs so I got shorted on the Hannahs as well which was annoying um, I'm gonna go ahead and pull him across
Oh, well, you've got, okay, you've got a wood merlin and you've got two bass. Just put them in the same team. This way you're almost guaranteed to get the heal off each time on your wood merlin. So your wood merlin does all the damage. I mean, you'd have to fluff it out with some other stuff, put some light dark team stuff on there, but it's doable. All right, and my light guy, let's see if I grabbed him. Storage, throwing stuff back across. You're gonna go across, you're gonna go across. Actually, not here, we're gonna go across like that. I actually, oh, uh, you got, you did 10 eggs and got it? Ah. Uh, I actually, I got one of the light dudes and I've run him up to 60 because I'm going to use him and the light Chipotle, the vampire, the fancy butler vampire dude. Um, I actually plan on using him for some stuff. So I had to do another one. It took me like an extra 80 eggs before I got another one to show up, um, which was annoying, but whatever. Uh, okay, so let me think for a second here. I would need... I would need two Nikes to clear the Nike off. Push you back that way. No, I would need one Nike to clear the Nike out of the inventory. I would need two Suras. I would need one Neza. Although I don't think you can hatch Nezas. Lokis don't really do me anything useful. Sort of like elements, not kinds. Okay, two Suras, one Nike. A Neza, a Hannah, a Cupid. <laughs> I've got so many singletons that I can, if I got, I would be able to make the Evo 3 versions of Critters. So I might just work on doing that for a minute. See what I can actually hatch. Or, or I could hatch some of my eggs that I have. I was going to wait till I had a thousand eggs before I hatched them. What do you guys think? Should I hatch eggs? Um, the water wendigo. I didn't think I had water wendigo sitting around. Did I have water wendigo sitting in that place? Oh, I did have... Oh, I forgot I kept those in there. You're right. Thank you for spotting that. Didn't realize I had that sitting there and was not feeding them like I should have. They were kept there as fodder specifically to do that, and I didn't bother checking that I had them there waiting. Monsters, wood... Oh, I don't, I don't need to astro guide the Wendigos. The Wendigos I'm using to make unicorns. That's Wendigos equal unicorns. Unicorns equal, uh, unicorns equal the thingy I need, the dark version of her, so that then I can make my light version into the cool, cool chick she's going to be. But I need more of her and I'll be doing runs to catch her. Oh yeah, but the water, wind, the water Wendigos I can catch whenever though, so I'm not so worried about the Water Wendigos because you just catch them on the map. They're not, they're not big deals to me. 
<laughs> I, I find it amusing. I can make him if I want to get rid of two units that I actually like. So no, I'm not going to make the Shiva and melt off those units. I think I will hatch the eggs though. Um, storage, I now have another unicorn I can pluck out. And actually, intelligence storage wise, I think I had a fire and a water elephant that I can combine up as well. So I'm going to do that as well. So, do the water elephants. Because they're going to be fodder going towards the, the other unit anyway, eventually. Hey, Doom Master. I, I do have a lot of units, not as many as some other people have. Um, because I still only have the basic airship because I, I do not have money to throw at these super expensive rental ships. Toss those guys across. Toss those guys across. I need to put those together and then toss the unicorn back across. Yeah, I've I've had I probably had close to what you had of those eggs, and I hatched a whole bunch to get the second slight uh, vampire butler dude I needed. I call him a vampire butler dude because that's I mean honestly that's what he looks like, right? So that that's this dude right here. He's like a vampire butler, sort of. Anyway. I think he's a, I actually think he's a useful unit so at some point, because especially since he's a light predator, I'm going to, some point, I'm going to take him against other people's all light based teams and I'm going to use him to destroy them, which I find very amusing because he'll just do a lot more damage than, than they would be expecting him to do. Anyway, um, I was going to look at my summons. I guess I can do some eggs, so I think I will because I don't feel like waiting till a thousand at this point because it'll take me the rest of the year. And maybe I can get one of the other four stars that I need. That's disappointing. In theory, by the way, if you do a hundred egg summons, you should get one five star. In reality, as you just noticed, I've done 20 summons and I've gotten no four stars. I guess I can pull the Kokomaru back across because obviously I'm going to be getting Kokomarus since that's what it's wanting to give me. Uh, light Kokomaru, come back across. Oh wait, you know what? I think I've been built the light Kokomaru once before. I'm going to have to check now if I did. Well, you know what? I'll find out in a minute. I built him once before when I put him in there, then I won't get the Astro Guide boost from it. Yeah, see, that's the thing. The, you should have a 1% chance of getting a 5 star, and I did not get the Astro Guide boost from doing that, which tells me that he is not, he's one I've already done and thrown away at some point because I thought he was a useless unit. It might have been they changed the skill set on him. Yeah, I have built him previously. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe... Maybe... Who knows? Maybe they did change the skill set to that from something else. Recent storage, recent.
You know, it actually is depressing to go through so many eggs and not get a single four star out of them. Wow, and still no four star out of those. <laughs> I'm sorry. Water, water mijos love me? Because they know I don't have any use for them and I just discard them? Yeah, I mean, I I just have wolves that continually build up on me. I mean, you saw that I've got like five wolves sitting in there at Evo 2 each. Or some ridiculous... Oh, I meant to hit skip all. No real reason to wait on these guys. Okay. So this is going on 60 eggs and not a single four star from 60 eggs. That's that's whacked. I should have. I should, and you guys are witness to it. I should have gotten at least a, a single four star out of it at this point, and I have not. Wow, all of those were useless, and the bird. Okay, a four star is a banshee. 70 in, a single four star. Okay, and there's a five star. Well, I guess, so 70 in, one four star, one five star. Five star is useful for me, at least, because that's an Odin, and the Odin is who I'm actually got the contract with, and I don't have enough Odins to do uh, a full Odin set with her. So I think the one I have is a fire Odin that I'm working on building up. There, there it is. Oh, that said, they're so rare, combining them up would be silly anyway. Because I would, I just need to use gleams for that. So that was a water Odin. So now I have two Odins. So if I get one more, I'll be able to gleam it out. Yeah. So 70 in, one four star, one five star. That's wax. <laughs> I got two eggs in return. <laughs> They're like, hmm, we, we want another life. We're going to come back to you as an egg. Try again. Alright, so that wasn't a bad set though. Uh, be 
because I got new two across. Not one to do that, which means I can make another unicorn. <laughs> Let me go look at my nezzes real quick. Sure not to overlap. Let me hit up the summon you. Unicorn, you, 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 you. I can actually do another unicorn. So that'll get me another. That gets me a lot closer, so that's cool. All right. So I need to get out another wood wendigo, and I need to pull one of my pen pens out. When to go and do I not have another pen pen ready? I might not actually have another pen pen ready. Let me pull you out first. Let's see. I do not have another pen pen ready at the moment. Well, go ahead and pull them out anyway. So summon over. Merlin. Unicorn. Actually, no, do I need to go through? Maybe. Actually, before I go there, let me check. Oh, yeah, no. Actually, it just has been Evo 2. But if I do that, I end up losing er, 60 Astro Gems, which is why I generally take them to Evo 3. So I'm not going to shortchange myself the Astro Gems, so I'm not going to do that mail just yet for that one. But we'll do the unicorn. Oh, I didn't actually pull the Neza out from here that I needed, so let me get that Neza. Neza, Neza. Did I pull it out already? Nope, there it is. Oh, how long did it take you to get your second one? I took for me, I literally went through 80 of those things before I got my second one to show up. I got the first one within about 20 or 30 total. All right, so the Neza, put the Neza back. Toss it over to Yuki, who I don't need to keep here. 
Excuse me. All right, so let's do like that. Quest, challenge, reward, back, jump, summon, incubators, eggs, hatch, hatch. 196 eggs left. You had like 280 or something to start with, right? Let's get. Hey, look, it's a variance. Miho. Shocker. <laughs> Another five star! A wood monkey king! I got a wood monkey king as a five star. I didn't think he was one that you could get out of an egg. I okay, I'm I'm just confused at this point. I didn't think the wood monkey king was one you could get out of just an egg. But I guess you can, so congrats me. Yay! That's cool. Um, well, now I've got multiple units to work on leveling up. Uh, storage. We're going to go over to recent. All right. By the way, just case in point, I think I've gotten two four stars and two five stars out of about a hundred something eggs I've hatched right now. I don't think I have any loose monkey king, so he's the only monkey king I've got sitting around right now. I've got my Evo 3 water monkey king. And for some reason I thought he was an event only unit, but I guess not. I won't complain about it though. Alright, so I actually do have some reasons to hatch up um, eggs now, uh, or not eggs, the, um, so I got 40 left, so let me do the rest of the eggs, then I'm going to get my gleams for the month. By the way, I hate taking units out of my temporary storage, so I don't do it. <laughs> Which is why you see me do until I have my space filled up, and then I go and manage it. It's just because I literally hate doing it the other way. storage. There's a bird outside my window. I'm sure you can hear it chirping. Brains out. <laughs> it's funny. It's just funny to do the, all these hatchings and then get all these eggs back. They're like, oh, we really want you to hatch us again. Give us another shot. What was it you forgot? <laughs> oh, the temp bed. Yeah, because you can eventually lose them if you leave them in there too long. And then you have to click on them one at a time, which I just find really annoying. All right, so let me do the rest of these eggs. I got 20 more to go, 22 more to go. Let me do all three of them. And then I guess I get the side eggs. Oh, you only have two days to get them out. Oh, yeah, even worse. It's a very temporary bag. Vampire. 
the last two. I'm going to go and do the side eggs also. I need to deal with the space. I'm not going to have enough, right? I'm going to end up in temp storage also. Storage, you, you. Ah, uh, six days for so like rewards out of the story stuff. Six days. Other than that, not six days. All right. So, Neza. Do I have another Neza over here at the moment? I don't think so because I just made that fire Neza. So she's gonna get tossed over to storage. I got space. I'll toss the vampire over there too for the moment. Kokomaru's join the hands and hold. Be happy. And oh, no, wrong spot. Eggs. Hey, I got a four star. Oh, there's a Vic. Oh, two four star. Look at that. Two and two is fifty percent on that pull. <laughs> Amusing. And then none. And then the last one of these eggs. And then I'll do my ten two to four stars. Oh, a four star on that one. Wow. They really wanted to be reborn as victorious. And so they were. So we'll hatch those guys. Okay. I had a higher percentage of getting four stars on the two to four eggs than I did on the one to th on the three to five eggs. Just just pointing that out. My percentage was higher on the two to four eggs. Oh, what's showing up over here? Oh, okay, so I can do that one. I knew that, but what else was showing up over here? Oh, I could make you to make the Nike, but I don't need to do that, so I'm not. And I definitely don't have the stuff to do that. All right. Um, all that said, I wanted to see if I could do a gene. <laughs> Probably can't. Looking for my four stars I could put into making my little guys, but I think I've pulled most of them through already. I was working on rebuilding them. Could pull the Yaksha. Could pull two Yaksha. All right. It would be worth it for me to see if two Yakshas. I could do a Sura. I could do a Cupid. I need a Cupid. So we'll go ahead. I can do two. Okay. The Cupids are going to be worth doing. I can do the Leo. All right, I'm just going to do them until I ran out of space. Yeah, that was a lot of four stars from the two to four star eggs. Um, I mean, the average, there's none. If you're lucky, one on a 10 pull on that. So that one. Go ahead and pull you. Loki. Pull a sir. I'll come back to the Yakshas.
hands are a while out the jeans are because I've pulled them earlier to try pushing my dark jean. All right, so back to storage. Oh no, I, I'm at 299. <laughs> I've got to push one across. That's, that was, okay, I can fix that. I'll just get rid of the three stars I don't need. Which would be those, at least. Okay, that would have been sad <laughs> if I couldn't have gotten any out because it filled up. Um, all right, so did I grab a Nike out of that patch? I did, so we'll toss the Nike cross. And if I have a Nike, that means I have... Another Nike somewhere further down? Yep. So both of those across. The Nike's almost done at this point. So it was fire. <laughs> and then put the end of the dip. Oh, no, don't do that. The other way. That has to be done the other way. And actually... I already have a wood one, I think, that has a piece in it. I do. Okay, yeah, let's not make that mistake. takes fire. The other wood unit gets its lock put back on. Toss those back across. I end up with a Lupin. I think I have a Lupin in progress, too. I do. Toss them back. The funky, funky back and forth inventory management stuff going on here. Select. Toss in. Sarah can come across. Cupid. And the wood Cupid. Can come across. And I think that'll finish my Evo 3 wood Cupid out. So let's see, you, evolution, that one, evolution, um, Reaper, I got your message, I'm going to have to look and see. I haven't watched that.
Wood is the other way. Wood, water, toss. And All right, so I've now completed a wood cupid, which I had not done so previously. Honestly, its base skill is pretty useless, but the shield is useful. All right, so let's toss him back. Toss for the moment. I'll have to decide if I'm going to keep him later or not. The water Leo. Bring him across. You're on season two of that? Okay. I've I've got so much stuff I need to be watching. Nope, I need to toss the toss them back across for the time being. I just got a lot of stuff I can work on leveling up now, so that's cool. I had basically run out of stuff to level up since the last time I did the Heroes Festival a month ago. So I'm glad I've got more units I can work on again. Um, Grab the astrogens. The water. Water Leo. Oh, hello, Papaya. You walk right over and bump right into my leg. Hey, girl. How many episodes is it per season? So then I've got Cerros. My cat's walked over, bumped against me, turned around, and is now staring at me because all of this was to tell me that I need to get up and actually go give her food. Even though she's had plenty of food. 11 to 12 per, se per uh, season. Okay, that's not too bad. Uh, if I hatch another Sura, I'll be at an Evo 2 Sura. And I would need three Yakshas to do another Yaksha. So I can do the Sura. Toss the Nike back across. the Leo back across. Toss the Wendigo across. I don't think I have any lighter dark units to shift. Alright, so let me grab a Sura. Oh, I might have hatched it already. Do two Yakshas. I would need three Yakshas, so not worth doing that. I guess I did the Sur already, which is why I'm not seeing it now. But that's okay, too. All right, I do apparently have a crap load of three stars in my inventory. I don't need to stay here, so we're going to deal with that. Pots. Fairy tale attack on Titan. Okay. 
Oh, hi, I'll get up and give you some food in a moment, girl. Oh, good. I've got a wood version to finish out. There he is. Hi. Release. I know I do have a Sura there. I can pull him out and make that a Sura. Yeah, okay, let's do that. The variant Sura. <laughs> you just get watching it. Nice. Sometimes things will just draw you in. All right, so that's not bad for my inventory. I've got my entire main stash over there filled, but I've got 24 free slots right now. That should see me through until the next time we have a, uh, a new four-star festival. Hopefully it'll be one that'll be useful for me. Aha, I've got my reward for him. No, I am not going to do another pull. Even though I technically have enough, I am not throwing more into that right now. I'll just, these will start going towards next festival, uh, next Hero Fest. Um, I did need to go to the shop because I want to get my gleams, which I had not done yet, for the month. Where are they? There they are. I, by the way, have never gotten a variance gleam. Now I probably should have just skipped all on this. There's no reason to go through it at this point. It doesn't matter. And still haven't gotten a variant gleam. Were they all water gleams? No, one fire. No wood, which would have been useful for the Monkey King. Um, but that's okay because the the two... Odin's that I have are fire and water and so that's what I needed to make them up to getting them towards the Evo 2 for the dark contract when that comes along. Uh, somewhere is my fire one. There, let's go by elements instead. Oh, you want to get it from there? Well, I've, I've never gotten it, period, so at some point, it would be nice to get it, but has not happened as of yet. Alright, so I've got a fire. Oh, damn it. It's annoying. I have to come over here to get them. Uh, I'll have to come over here to get them. Alright. Are my gleams. They're there. Fire and water. Was that already in Evo 2? Oh, okay, that's why, because she's already Evo 2. Well, then I don't need to put any on her. So the water is not already Evo 2. So she's actually one thing away. Anybody else that's fire that I need to put gleams on? Probably not. Let's see over here. Hmm. 
I do not believe I have anything else to put a fire gleam on right now. So all my fire things, five stars and up are even the best, I think, or Evo 2. Yep, even the best. Um, hmm. Oh, you're right, I did have more of those guys hiding in there. I can take out and free some inventory space up. And I can make another... All right, this helps me out a lot. I'm not sure why my brain was not registering that I had more of those in there, but I do, so I can. Let me actually go to wood first. Wood... Lucian, toss those in. And then summon make myself a unicorn. Helps me put stuff in there that way. Oh, oops, no, go back. Don't need the unicorn in here, and we can go back across as well. Hello, BB. All right. So, what's a good way to build a monkey, a wood monkey king? Nice if I got most of his woods. <laughs> He's got a little electric bike driving around. That's cute. He's an attacker. Would you build a wood monkey king tank like, or would you build it attack right based? And what gems do I even have available right now? Resist hit points, but it is an attack gem. Although, crap substats. Attack boosts, crit rate boosts. Substats are pretty crappy, but it is an attack gem. Do I have. I need a little, oh, I need, I need two diamonds anyway. Crap for those. I could make him an incredibly resistant unit. <laughs> That's wrong. <laughs> oh, huh, I could do two attack set gems, although the sub the substats are pretty crappy, but he would have a whole bunch of attack based on that if I did it that way.
Wow, I don't have any blue available diamond gems at all. That's awesome. Okay, so I'm not using blue. My cat Vivi is just sitting here staring at me. Oh, I could go that gem. Some percent defense on it. So I have some purple attack base gems. No. Well, I do if I want to go five star gem instead of a six star gem. Evie. What 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 you doing? And then you sort of just sort of stretch on my keyboard. You know what? I think I'm probably gonna hold off on figuring out what I'm gonna do with that for right now. Because I'm starting to get a headache. Because I've been up for a long time and not had much sleep. I'm gonna go to the gym and work out, get some exercise. Um before I do that. I'm going to have you guys take a look at something and see which one you think I should print first. Alright, so for those that I was recording this for, I'm going to stop the recording here. For those still watching,